still breeding season here at Running Springs, and we are attempting to put in embryos into our last couple of mares, being Willow and Ethel. So today we're just checking to see where they're at in their cycle. Hopefully they will ovulate soon, and we can time up ordering those embryos to put in. So last time we checked Willow, she had a two on her right, uh, which is not a breedable follicle, but she was building it. Um, you don't just need big follicle size. You also need good edema and all of the right pieces in order for them to ovulate and it be successful. So let's hope she's building a bigger follicle and has some edema building, and then we can time out her ovulation. We have edema. Let's have a good follicle now. Repeat on the, we have a good edema. We have not found the good follicles yet though. We gotta have both, Willow. JK, good follicle too. Where it at though? Where it at? Matt seen it, so it's there. That's the tomato, she's in heat. All right, how big you think? I say a three, cause he could go from top to bottom. Let's see who's right. Matt said three, four. Three eight. Three eight. You, you know, eight, you know eight, what? Eight. You play with me on the Zoom sometimes, and it messes with me. And next is Ethel. We are interrupting dinner. Ruby, you have to be good. You can't try to come through the window, okay? Dale will be here as your emotional support, but we have learned that you do try to escape sometimes, and we don't need that to happen. She's got to get one last little snack before Mama leaves for a total of five minutes. Spray bottle at the ready. I promise you, you'll live. She is a lot better than some. Like, Ted, Ted doesn't handle it at all. He's going to take weaning really hard. All right, Ethel. Let's see what you got, pretty girl. All right, some smaller ones on the right side. And her left side, I mean, she looks great to do ICSI. She's got one that's maybe like a two, maybe. So both of these mares, we're going to check again on Monday. And then next week, we have lots of preg checking to do. I think we're preg checking like five of them. So let me know if you have any questions and stay tuned for more.